true or do not, there is no crime. Open the three pieces of pie template. Change the image from index mode to RGB mode. Click on the magic wand tool and then select the first red piece. You should see marching ants around it. Then we're going to select, modify, expand by two pixels, and then click OK. Create a new layer and call this layer 1. Then you're going to open up your new image that you want to use for the pattern. And I'm using a butterfly and then you're going to control A, select all of it, and then control C to copy it. Toggle back to your template and then go to edit, paste into selection. Your image should now appear within that piece of the pie and then move it around until you get exactly the coloring that you want for that piece of the pie. Right-click layer 1 and choose Duplicate Layer. Change this to layer 2 and click OK. Make sure you're on layer 2 and go to Image, Rotate, Flip Layer Horizontal. Go back to Image, Rotate, Free Rotate Layer, and then change it to negative 60 degrees and then move the piece using the Move tool into position number two. Go back to layer one, right click and duplicate the layer. Name it layer three and click OK. Make sure you're on layer three. Go to image, rotate, free rotate layer and change it to negative 60 degrees again. Use your Move tool to move it into position number three. Hold down the Control key while selecting layers one, two, and three and choose Merge Layers. Then you're going to rename this layer to Merge Layer 1. Right-click on Merge Layer 1 and duplicate the layer. Call this Merge Layer 2. Then you're going to go to Image, Rotate, Flip Layer Horizontal, and then you're going to choose the Move tool and move that piece into place. Hold the control key and select Merge Layer 1 and 2, and then Merge the Layers. Then you're going to rename this to Merge Layer 3. Duplicate Merge Layer 3 and name it Merge Layer 4. Then you're going to go to Image, Rotate, and Flip Layer vertical. Use the Move tool to move the last piece into position. Right click the background layer and delete it. And then hold down your control key and select Merge Layer 3 and 4 and merge the layers. Then rename this to Mandala Layer.
I'm going to increase the canvas size by going to Image, Resize, Canvas Size. Making sure the box relative is checked, switching it to Pixels, and choosing 100 by 100. Then I'm going to color it black with the Paint Bucket tool. No, I really don't like black, so I'm going to undo. I'm going to use my eyedropper tool, choose a color within, like green, use my paint bucket, color it green. Yeah, I like that. Now I'm going to put a frame around it, so I'm going to choose black, which is all zeros, click OK, and I'm going to choose a pen, you could use a square brush, whatever brush you want. I'm going to draw a line and hold the shift down at the same time so you can draw a straight line. And I'm going to draw that line going on the outside of my mandala. Do not. There is no fire.